Hello YouTube and welcome to my Sky Viper V2450 GPS motor replacement video. You can see from the video we have one propeller not spinning. We cut it up in a plastic bag and burnt the motor out. And the first thing we're going to do is unplug the battery and unscrew the prop. And I'm going to bring up the website here for the replacement parts. If you just Google Sky Viper V24 replacement parts, you get to this website on the first link. You'll navigate to the page that has the parts for the Sky Viper V2450. And uh, we ordered motors and C clips and washers and um, gears and stuff and extra props, but you can order anything you want. They're very reasonably priced. The next thing we're going to do here is remove the 10 screws in the battery holder. I sped the video up so you guys don't have to watch this at uh, real time. And I've, yeah, there's 10 uh, screws all the way around and the little holder pops off just like that. This is my friend Jason taking off the, uh, taking apart the Sky Viper and doing the filming. And you can see here he's, now that he's got the uh, screws out, he's prying off the black part uh, in the channel. And you pry it up from the body and then it pops away from the prop and he's got it out of the way here and now he's uh, taking the wires and he's just moving them out of the way and now he's working on the uh, sea washer he's taking the sea washers off and the prop gear which will pop out here and that's to put to the side and then you carefully pop out the motor from the motor holder and that pops out super easy it just comes right out and now here you want to be uh, pretty careful what you want to do now where he's going to pull the or pop the uh, little connector off you want to take something to pry off the connector. We're using these pliers. They're not cutters. They are cutters, but we're not cutting anything. And he just pops it off with the uh, pliers. He grabs the little edges and pops it off. And then he's uh, attaching the new motor now to the uh, to the connector. Now there's two kinds of motors. Some that have the blue and red wire and some that have a white and red wire. You want to make sure you're changing out the motor with the same color wires. The wires, uh, the colors of wires control which way the prop spins. And so you want to make sure that you use the uh, correct motor so if you take out a wire with blue and red you're replacing it with blue and red as well and if you uh, take out one with the other color you want to swap those out that's why it's always good to order um, official Sky Viper parts because they have color coded and they have the right connectors and they're pretty simple and you can see we're reassembling everything here in the reverse order we took everything apart or almost the reverse order he um, he didn't put the gear back in um, the prop gear back in yet but he'll get to that right away and uh, he has a little difficulty replacing um, or putting the C-clip right here. He's going to have a bit of difficulty trying to pop this C-clip back in or C-washer. And so I've ha I was able to pop them off quite easily. So he asks for my assistance and you'll see me come in here in a second and uh, help him pop it on. It uh, went flying across the table at one point and hit the floor, which we found, but then I come along right there, there's me, and popped it on. The whole process took about 20 minutes from start to finish. Um, it was around 22, I think, and you can see that now all the motors are firing, and we're going to actually take off from the table here, fly up in the air. Anyways, that's it today, guys. It's a short video, but it is super easy to change this uh, motor, um, super easy to change the gears. It's a really nice drone to work on. It's an amazing, um, it's amazing how inexpensive this is, and I look forward to next video. Thanks guys.